blessed afternoon. There is Absam Salas rally again from Blackbird United Kingdom. And um, of course, our uh, holiness. Pope Francis, His Holiness Pope John Paul, and His Holiness Pope Francis, head of the Catholic Church in Vatican. So, um, I have made an essay about uh, Luke the Holy Bible and when Jesus addressed his disciples so I have written made an essay this morning and um, Jesus said so I'm on my knees in the presence of our Lord God Almighty again and so Jesus said love God with all your heart mind body and soul and of course we all know the lord's commandment thou shall not um, commit adultery uh, thou shall not uh, bear false witness thou shall not uh, steal and um, thou uh, honor thy father and thy mother and in Tagalog wag kang makikiapit sa hindi mo asawa wag kang magnanakaw wag kang papatay ibigin mo ang iyong ama at ang iyong ina so before I start I would like to say again I believe in God the Father Almighty creator of heaven and earth and in Jesus Christ his only son our Lord conceived by the Holy Spirit born of the Virgin Mary suffered under Pontius Pilate was crucified died and was buried he descended into hell and on the third day he rose again ascended into heaven sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty from whence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. So when our Lord Jesus Christ addressed his disciples, um, he mentioned forgive and you will be forgiven so we never look back to all the negativities that's happening in our life we pay attention to all the possibilities that we have to make sure that we're not going to hurt any persons or people because um, we contribute to uh, their happiness of course and how do we do it uh, by sharing the kindness of our heart and it feels really good if we do it from the bottom of our heart uh, we can do a simple smile and uh, we have to make sure that we really mean it that um, uh, without anything against anybody um, our Lord Jesus Christ said also why even the hairs on our head are numbers nothing hidden shall be made into manifest our lord jesus christ said um we never kept the secret uh, to people around us regarding the truth to set them free from worries because we love one another 
like our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, love for each and every one of us. He suffers, so we have the chance to make a repentance of our sins. And so that we will be able to save our souls. We have the Holy Catholic Church to be baptized, just like John the Baptist. And during the time of our Lord Jesus Christ at the Holy Land in Jerusalem. And those who wish to be saved, there is a Holy Communion. So after we receive the Holy Communion, we stay away from committing sins. Um, and keep following and obeying our Lord's commandments. So that our sins will be forgiven. And when it's our Lord's time, the resurrection of body and life everlasting. So we never show insincerity to other people. If we say something, we meant it with good and genuine intention because we care and we never hurt. So we never meant to hurt everyone around us. Our love for our God. The Father Almighty is always shown through kindness and good heart that we give to our family and others through the act of sharing to others who are in need of Word of God. This is done by Holy Catholic Church priests, for instance. Sick people who were unable to go to church and in poor living condition. And uh, food as well. We all know that a lot of rich people make their donations to church and our Holy Catholic Church send their missionaries, nuns and priests to reach hand and bring this good news to the poor like our Lord Jesus Christ said. So there's also a uh, the word from our Lord Jesus Christ, condemn not and you will not be condemned. Judge not and you will not be judged. We avoid making negative comments about a certain person because we know that we are all God's people and we want and wish the best for others as we want for others, for ourselves, for instance, possess a kind and genuine heart. The best of our virtue, patience, wisdom, faith to our God, the Father Almighty, and to our Savior, our Lord Jesus Christ. We all need each other to rely upon, especially during the very moment that our love is required by a vulnerable person. So in Tagalog, uh, ang pagmamahal ng buong puso isip at kaluluwa sa ating Panginoong Diyos pag-aalay ng ating sarili pagmamahal sa kapwa sa ating pamilya sa mga nangangailangan at ang pagkakaroon ng busilak na puso ang kabaita ng ating puso ay ating ibinabahagi sa ating kapwa at sa ating mga mahal sa buhay iyon ang mga kautusan ng ating Panginoong Heso Kristo upang tayo ay masagip sa ating mga kasalanan. Naririyan ang simbahang katolika, handang tumanggap ng baptismo, upang sa ganun tayo ay makatanggap ng komunyon, banal na komunyon, at nang tayo ay mapatawad sa ating mga kasalanan. Pagkatanggap ng banal na komunyon, iiwasan na natin po ang ating mga paggawa po ng mga kasalanan. At nang sa ganun, ang ating pong mga kaluluwa ay magkaroon ng kapayapaan at makapiling ang ating mahal na Panginoong Heso Kristo. So, ito po ang pinapahayag ng ating banal na salita ng Diyos mula sa simbahang katolika na tayong lahat ay uh, anak ng ating Panginoong Diyos. Ang ating Panginoong Heso Kristo ay naghirap upang nang sa ganun uh, mabigyan tayo ng pagkakataon 
na ma maisalba ang ating sarili sa mga hirap na dinaranas natin. Pagsubok, ano po ang dapat gawin? Siyempre po, dapat tayo ay magsimba, mangumunyon, at umiwas sa mga kasalanan. So, iyon po ang mabuting pahayag at ang kabutihan ng ating puso ibahagi sa ating pamilya at mga mahal sa buhay, sa mga may sakit, at katulong natin ng banal na simbahan, ang mga pari, ang mga misyonero, at ang mga madre. Iyan po ang mabuting balita ng ating Panginoon. At naway mapagpalang uh, araw sa ating lahat. God bless us all!